Today I'm going to be showing you how to install your door closer LED light combo. So the first thing we need to do is determine which hinge side our door is on. And what we want is for our rod to be closest to our hinge side with our lens facing out. Now if this were an opposite side hinge, we uh, would reverse the closer inside the case. And I'll show you how to do that. To reverse our closer if needed, we're going to start at the bottom and undo our snap hooks. Work our way across the bottom. And from here the case opens up hinge. Now this is where you take your closer and be able to flip it over. Insert back into the case. And the easiest way to start these is to align the top of the hinge so with all these hooks. And then start at one corner and snap it back together. Now to install our jam bracket, we need to take some dimensions off the Z-bar and the jam. Now we already have our pre-existing holes here, but if you were to drill new, you'd want to measure from the bottom edge of the Z-bar down at least an inch and a quarter, and from the back edge of the Z-bar a half inch to our front holes. That gives us proper alignment and allows the closer to actually open it up past the Z-bar. With our jam bracket installed, we're going to put our hold open bracket onto our rod, take our short connecting pin, and connect the closer to the jam bracket. We're then going to take our door bracket and long connecting pin, and connect that to the end plug of the closer. Now from here we're going to line it up parallel, so that it's horizontal, and we're going to mark two hole locations to drill for our next hole. So we're going to mark the very end holes and we're going to then disassemble and take off our door bracket. With our holes pre-drilled, we're going to take our door bracket and our door bracket spacer and we're going to install our door screws. Now what we take note of is that when we drilled our previous holes, we had them in the very outside hole. Now we're going to preload it and we're going to put it into the next hole over. That gives the closer proper preload. We're going to tighten this down and install our second screw. Now that we have our door bracket installed, we're going to take our long connecting pin, extend our closer out to line up with the hole, slide it through, and that completes the installation. Install or replace our 9 volt battery, we're going to rotate our hosing up, remove our battery door, pull out our wiring, and connect. And then we're going to slide our battery back into the housing, reinstall our battery door, and rotate the closer back down to its proper position.